my name is Paman. Welcome to my channel Gizmos Boy. And in this video, I'm going to show you. Wait, not in the regular way. So this is my new device, guys, the Tenori that I purchased from Amazon few days ago. I bought this device for rupees seven thousand, and this variant is a three GB RAM and thirty two GB variant. So let me just give you a physical overview, just a small overview, and then just. I'll just enter into the topic. So the front we have the 5.5 inch Full HD display with the Corning Gorilla Glass 3 support, and we have this uh, speaker vent and this uh, 5 megapixel primary camera, the uh, LED flash for front camera, which is a good thing, and the LED notification lights. As you can see, it's getting lit up. And on the bottom we have nothing. It's just a bezel, guys. It doesn't have any capacity touch screen. The uh, the navigation buttons are the on-screen navigation buttons. Coming to the back, it has a 30 megapixel camera. The primary micro, uh, sorry, the secondary noise cancellation mic, the single tone LED flash, and a fingerprint scanner that works very fine as I've already tested it. The tenor branding, some confirmation part, the tenor IME number. And coming to the bottom, we have the uh, USB charging port, the speaker vent, and the micro, primary microphone. And on the left, we have two slots one is for micro SD card, single micro SD card. And the other is for two nano sim guys. And on the top we have the 3.5 mm headphone jack. And this is about the physical overview guys. And I'll be making some few videos regarding this device regarding various topics so that you'll get a familiar idea about this device. So in this first video I'm going to tell you that what are the sensors that are available in this device. As I've received many requests from many users and many of the users have many doubts regarding this device. Whether what are the sensors available on this device whether this device skips the sensor like samsung on 7 prime or it gives the basic set of sensors let's find out in this video so uh, let me just show you how the fingerprint works as you can see just a tap is enough for this device to unlock so i tested it and it works very fine and considering the pr price range it's very good so let me just open the app called my device i just prefer this app because it gives all the basic set of information that you want so in this video the primary topic is about the sensors so i'll be showing you what are the sensors available on this device and how many sensors are available so let's go to the sensor tab as you can see this device supports 39 sensors which is equal to the redmi note 4 in the redmi note 4 guys it also has the same set of 39 sensors 39 odd sensors are available on this device also for the price range of 7000 with 3 gigs of ram so it's a very good thing guys I too didn't expect that this device will get a such a huge bunch of sensors with it, packed with it. So I was I felt very happy by seeing this image itself, that the top itself, the 39 sensor seeing itself, I felt very happy. As you can see, it has the primary gyroscope and calibrated gyroscope, accelerometer, accelerometer basic sensor, the magnetometer also it has, some gyroscope, secondary, etc, etc, gravity sensor also it has, step counter, step detector, etc, sorry and various uh, sensors are available which are difficult to point it out but it has 39 odd sensors on this device so you should not be facing any problem with regards with the sensors issue as the device supports 39 odd sensors the redmi note 4 which was the one of the famous devices of 2016 also supports a 40 sensor which is one one sensor more than this so it doesn't make really sense because the it's a 7k price range and you are getting 39 sensors so dear guys you, have, you could have get a clear idea about how many sensors are available on this device so this is my primary intention to show you and i'll be making some videos regarding this one on some other topics and find it out in my next video so this is iphone signing off bye bye